value of the sub, sub step not always good for your scene. Sometimes lower the lower the sub step will um, will fine tune the effect. Um, if I change to about eight. So as you can see, um, you you can uh, change this parameter or change the gravity. Uh, you can change m uh, many many things to faking the character are uh, shoot and uh, and are uh, 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 shoot by arrow and uh, fall down to the ground. Now, um, um, everything is set. The uh, the back pad is uh, create a fall down motion by using rea uh, reactor max script and uh, the motion the motion of the arrow are create. Um, so the final question is uh, how to um, uh, after the arrow uh, hit arrow sh shoot shoot the shoe on the bipad how to fix the arrow on the bipad um, first I select this arrow it um, very simple just um, go to the motion motion panel and uh, select the transform and uh, assign a link constraint to the to the arrow so before before the arrow touch touch the before the arrow touch the character the bipad you can you you set the arrow link to the wall and uh, after after the bipad penetrate or touch the bipad you set another key you set a link to uh, add a link add a link and uh, here I, I create another dummy and the dummy link to the bipad so well, now you uh, add a link and uh, link the arrow to the dummy. Um, uh, why I create uh, a dummy for for the bipad? Because uh, if I if I if I if I don't create this dummy, and I, no, I delete it. So I select the arrow. And uh, add a link, and uh, 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 select uh, one bone. Select a bone of the bipad. Yeah, um, it it works fine. So you don't have to create a dummy. You just uh, add a link and select the bipad. Create a link constraint. Link constraint and. Uh, before, before, before touch the bipad, link to the world, and after touch the bipad, link to any part of the bi, any part of the, the bipad, and uh, you have you now you have it, you have this uh, this result. In this tutorial, um, I create a, a five bipad and uh, and uh, uh, create a geosphere. Uh, pretend this is uh, an explosion. And uh, actually, this is a, a, ver a very very simple, uh, very very simple scene. 
So um, you just create a five character as I mentioned before. Same same way to create a character, and uh, select any part of the pack. Any any part any bone of the bipad, and uh, and. Uh, You just run, uh, select the script and run the script. So how to to create a, um, a motion like uh, those character are, uh, are shocked by the explosion? You just um, go to motion panel. And uh, use this tool. This uh, move a uh, uh, body horizontal or body vertical to move the biped. Uh, so initial set an initial key for the biped, and then go to friend about uh, uh, five, and then move the biped a little bit. So set another key friend. So all these five biped will use the momentum between zero and five run the simulation and the result will look like they are hit by the explosion they are shocked by the explosion um, as you can see the result like so um, mm, however it takes time to um, to fine tune it uh, to to this result um, several things you can do. Um, in this here, um, as you can see, I changed the uh, the mass of the biped foot to very high, about a uh, hundred, uh, uh, about a uh, 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 a thousand unit. Um, um, if you if you want to um, set if you want to have a different result uh, among different biped, you can um, set uh, each part of the each part of the, uh, the bone uh, with a different mass. So they will have a, a very uh, subtle but and a very various uh, uh, falling result. Also. Um, also here I, I set the gravity to very high about 800 um, so there, there are many uh, parameters you have to you have to change it, it and uh, play around and uh, remember um, uh, remember uh, if you, you change the uh, subset, subset also will have a different uh, also will have a different result and in this tutorial I create a scene um, 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 that's similar to uh, uh, there's a scene in uh, um, the movie face off the I just have a the have a idea from the the movie. So this character he's uh, moving toward a big fan, and uh, but uh, to catch a gun here, and uh, but uh, but uh, he blow away by the fan. So um, I'm not going to to tell you everything because it's uh, same uh, same way same concept. Uh, uh, um, like other tutorial. Uh, the big difference is uh, uh, I create a a win object uh, in here in the location of the. Uh, the fan geom uh, the fan geometry. So 
and uh, I set the the wind speed to very high. So you will get this result. Um, you have to play around every um, every parameter uh, to get a result you like. Um, this tutorial, um, uh, I just want uh, because it's a very simple. Cause uh, so I won't tell every de single detail in this tutorial. Um, uh, I create a, bo a box by boolean it, um, so this is a bunker and uh, this uh, very simple geosphere with uh, uh, the distortion and uh, this is this geosphere is a gene and uh, the gene is uh, throw in the bunker and uh, for a few seconds and uh, the biped The biped uh, was uh, was uh, shocked by the explosion. So, for the journey, it's the uh, same way to create uh, as uh, as the uh, arrow, the arrow tutorial. And um, I think there's only one little thing to 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 you need to know. Um, that is the property of the, this bunker. You have to set it to concave mesh. Therefore, the the genetic can penetrate, can go in the bunker. If you set it to uh, mesh convex hole, it will not go into the bunker. In this tutorial, I create a, a character jump suicide, and um, um, so um, so uh, from 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 here to here, it's a. Uh, uh, I load up a uh, motion capture file, it's a jump motion capture file. And uh, from here, it's a simulation by using Ragdoll Max script. So, just that it's just a uh, same concept as I as in, um, in the beginning tutorial. And I create several uh, simple box. So, so this is very simple and uh, one thing to to take to pay attention to is the um, collision tolerance um, because the box is stacking together um, you have to set the collision tolerance to low enough so um, so the box will um, will not uh, well, uh, very stable, or and uh, not uh, um, uh, flying or moving around in the beginning. So remember to set the collision tolerance to low enough. In this tutorial, um, I create two character. One is a uh, uh, walking backward, and uh, is uh, he's uh, dragging another female character, like so. So, um, both character are involved in uh, rea reactor simulation, and uh, the most Im important setting are the point-to-point -point constraint. Um, so, um, 